I'm here in the center of the action where I plan to make Chinese noodle. It's gonna take two days. Because first you have to mix up the noodle dough. Noodle noodle dough. Noodle dough. Noodle noodle dough. Sounds funny. Noodle that dough. Noodle dough. That noodle dough. That that noodle, noodle dough. dough. See my bee? It's nine and a half ounces of water, 14 ounces of flour, and two, excuse me, a half teaspoon of salt. And I just spilled some of it on the camera. So, you take the salt and mix it into the flour, and then mix the water into the flour salt mixture until there's no dry flour left. And then you're supposed to knead it. Oh. You have to use all purpose flour because bread flour, which is what I normally use, I had to go to the store and get the special, but bread flour has too much gluten and it won't allow it to stretch the right way, apparently, according to what I've read. This is one of those few recipes that actually matter. And you're supposed to stir it with chopsticks. I mean, just to be authentic. It said so in the instructions, stir it with chopsticks. <laughs> Delicious. It says need for 10 minutes. And then after it says, alternatively, you can use a stand mixer. Oh my god, what is this doing on my food? Now I'm going to put it in the fridge because it's got to rest overnight. Tomorrow we're having noodles and shrimp. Getting married is a wife's sentence. Ingredients, Biscoff cookies made of wheat flour, sugar, vegetable oil, contains one or more of soybean oil, sunflower, canola, or palm oil, soy flour, brown sugar, sodium bicarbonate as a leavening agent, salt and cinnamon, and that's what's in the cookie. And then it's mixed with canola oil, sugar, soy lecithin, citric acid, Best before, see jar lid.
since 1932. Doesn't say. Product of Belgium. Non-GMO. Vegan. Oh! I gotta put the dough in the fridge. So he asks me, Do you think I can staple water to a tree? So I say no. Apparently he can staple water to a tree. Time to start kneading the dough and then stretching the noodles. It's been sitting overnight in the fridge and now I left it out on the counter to kind of warm up so it wouldn't be ice cold. Don't know if you're supposed to do that. This is my first time. Oh my God. My camera lens is all covered in grease. recorded for a full five minutes without the camera on. I mean, I didn't record. <laughs> they make it look so easy in the videos. Oh my gosh, this is so hard to do. I think it's stretching pretty good though, so um, I'm gonna flour this down, start making it into wads of noodles. had better be the most delicious noodles ever eaten ever in the history of ever. Okay. Flour. And you pop water. This stuff is actually super yummy. You can send me this anytime. Biscoff cookie butter. What they do is they mash up cookies, mix it with oil, and cause a most delicious spread. I dipped chocolate in this yesterday. It was so good. That's probably not how you're supposed to do it. I'm not sure how you're supposed to do it. <sighs> that is not supposed to happen. Woohoo! I gotta find the directions. Ow! Dang it! That. Not like we're safe. The guy on the on the show is never happens. I watched the videos like a hundred times. Dear baby Jesus, find me a hand pulled noodle recipe. Oh, this is the coolest video ever. How to make hand pulled noodles at home, and it's cooks science. George is getting a little upset! Okay, we're gonna boil up some of these funky little pieces and see how big they puff up. I'm never gonna be Asian at this rate! God! Asian noodle bowl. Well, Those are actually super tasty. It's actually really good. Come taste some of these noodles. Man, those noodles. 
noodles tasted great. You want some more? Would you eat these again? Yes, definitely, right now. Mmm, <laughs> those are delicious. <laughs> I like that teriyaki sauce. Take your chef's hat and go. Okay. We're keeping that chef's hat. You just watch. I'll get good at this. Wow, I got a major stretch on that one. Look at the size of this thing. It's like almost three feet long. People who can actually do this, they, have, they must hold it in such a way that it's so gentle, yet so firm, that it doesn't break or drop or something. I've got some frozen shrimp, those little tiny corn, and I got water chestnuts. My can opener will work even after an EMP. If you think this is so easy, why don't you try it? What was that? Are we haunted? Wait, it's the microwave. It's the shrimps, they're screaming. There's a reason why they throw the noodles directly into the pot. They start to form back into one giant noodle again. I don't know how to do the noodle. I said George is getting a little 